Hello guys, Caden here, and so I'm going to bring you guys another story. And today, this is story is going to be about when I was in the elementary school again. And it was my birthday, and I got like a lot of birthday money from family and like cousins and stuff. And I had a lot. Like, I think I was up to like $400 from birthday money. And after school that day, my mom said that she didn't like go take me to Best Buy or somewhere and we were going to go get me a tablet with my birthday money and she's going to help me buy it so I didn't have to waste all my money. So I was like so excited at school. And I told all my friends, I was like, guys, I'm going to go get a, be getting a tablet and an iPod, whatever the fuck it was. I don't remember, I don't have it anymore. And they're all excited for me. And so, finally, after school, we get it. After, like, four hours on it, I got it to work. I figured out how to, like, download apps and stuff. And, like, my mom and dad were like, don't take it to school because you don't want to get it stolen or broken. I was like, okay, I won't. Like, knowing me, I promised all my friends and shit that I was going to bring it to school. So... Later that night, when everyone fell asleep, I snuck it in my backpack. And, yeah, I took it to school. So I go to school. And then our classrooms, our classrooms were, had, like, where they were attached to another room. Then it was, like, a room where you go and you set your jacket and backpack in. And I went in there. And I set everything down, and I took my iPad out, whatever it was. I'm not going to say it was an iPad, but I don't think it was. And I go into the class. And this teacher's sitting there blabbing and blabbing. I'm not listening to shit. And then, finally, I pull it out, and, like, everybody sees me. And then they're, like, all freaking out. Kaden, let me touch it, let me touch it. Let me play game, blah, 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 blah. I didn't get caught by my teacher because I said that I was just reading a book when I wasn't. I was playing like Flow or something. And if you guys don't know what Flow is, it's just a game where you like gotta like complete the maze or whatever. And um, everybody's like playing on it. Like I'm being really nice and just only letting my friends go on. I'm letting other people see it. And there's this kid who's just like staring at it. And I'm like, dude, what the fuck's your problem? But, like, I didn't say that because I was trying to be nice about it. And he comes over, and then he's just, like, staring at me, giving me this weird look. And at the time, I used to take the bus home, right? So, he comes up to me, and then he's like, hey, can I play on it for, like, ten minutes? And I was like, oh, no, man, sorry, I'm just letting my friends play with it. I mean, I would, but, like, we didn't, we're not really friends or anything. And then... He's like, come on, just let me see it. And I was like, no, dude. And then he just glares at me. And the rest of the day, me and my friends are just playing on it. I'm not paying attention, but you guys don't do that really in school. Pay attention. Yeah. So after school that day, to get to the bus, you got to, like, walk around the entire school. And at one point, there's, like, nobody over there. Except the students, so like if you got in a fight or anything, no one could see you. And there is a group of kids like forming a wall in front of me as I'm walking. I'm like, what the fuck is this shit? And I go up to him, and he's like, hey, let me play on your iPad. He's like, and then I'm like, no, because there's first of all, there's no Wi Fi, and I need to go home, so bye. And then he's like, give me your iPad or I'm gonna beat your ass. I'm like, oh, I was like, I was scared because, like, no one really cussed that much. And this kid was bigger than me. And he had, like, six kids with him. And he's in the middle of them. And so he takes my iPad. And I walk away. And one of them throws a fucking rock in my head. And I, I get pissed. And I'm like, are you fucking kidding me? It wasn't, like, a big rock. It was just a rock. So I'm fucking pissed off after this. So I go home and I'm crying and, and like Caden went to and I was like, oh nothing. I just felt school tape and they're like, where's your tablet? And then I was like, oh it's charging upstairs and they're like, okay. And so the next day, I was like, should I tell this kid to give me my fucking thing back? Should I tell on him? I don't know what to do. 
So in the morning, we go in to put our backpacks down, and he clearly had it in his jacket pocket, his coat pocket. And I'm like, dude, should I just steal this thing back? What should I do? After that, uh, I'm just thinking about it all day, and I'm scared. 30 minutes into class, he's playing it during snack time. And then, like, another 40 minutes, he's freaking playing on it still. So, I'm like, just thinking, oh, fucking tired. I'm like, I'm just thinking, should I steal it back? What should I do? And so, knowing me, I decide to steal it back. So, I asked the teacher, I was like, hey, can I go into the coat room and get my jacket? Because I'm kind of cold. I said some stupid excuse like that. So like, yeah, go ahead. And then he's like, uh, blah, 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 can Caden, or can I go in the coat room? And then she's like, no, because Caden's in there. And I go in there, I go in his backpack, and then right there, it's in his backpack. Like, I walk by, and the teacher wasn't looking, and I pulled it out, and I was just waving it in his face, and I was like, hey, hey, fuck you, bitch. And then after that, um... After that, it was the end of school, and I was the first one out. I went to the bus, got on the bus, plugged in my headphones, and listened to some music. And the kid was outside looking for me so he could steal it again. And I just flipped him off. And it fucking laughed in his face. So, for the rest of the year, you guys are probably thinking, did the kid try to fight you or anything? No, he never tried to fight me. There's plenty of chances where he could just, like, clock me in the back of the head, but he never did. And yeah, so thanks guys for watching. Please like and subscribe.